And that is the end. The three choices you get. If you'll notice, the three choices are kind of misleading, in my opinion. What would you, what would you, as Shepherd, a Paragon Shepherd, assume as the good way of ending the series? Destroying all Reapers, controlling the Reapers, or Synthesis? I go with destroy all Reapers, but, but quite clearly, it's red. Indicating that it's the Renegade option. While controlling the Reapers, I would assume would be the Renegade one, is made apparently clear that it's the Paragon. Kind of misleading, possibly another hint of indoctrination, but at the same time it could be just fucking idiots grasping at fucking straws. Now, I'm basically calling this... Th I'm, not calling what, I'm not calling one theory fucking idiotic or another theory idiotic. The thing that I'm calling idiotic that all of you are fucking arguing over is what one is fucking right. What argument is fucking right? Is the indoctrination theory right? Or is the literal theory right? I don't care! You shouldn't fucking care. You go with what one you think is more plausible. If you think that the indoctrination theory is more plausible than the literal theory, then you go with the indoctrination theory. If you think the literal one is more plausible than the indoctrination one, you go with the literal theory. I personally am on the indoctrination theory, okay? That is my opinion. But there are holes in the theory. Same with the literal fucking theory, there are holes in it. Both sides have holes the size of fucking ships. And then the fucking arch. How many of you get that reference? We're arguing over this. We are literally turning on each other because we disagree with the ending on what theory we want to go with. If you don't like any of the fucking theories, how about this? Make up your own. Make up the fact that the Reapers were giant fucking tomatoes. Make up the fact that the, the God Child is actually a younger shepherd. Make out the fact that you live happily ever after, you and for me, example, Tally, go erratic and you have fucking a hundred different fucking kinds of babies. And before you go, I do know it's biologically impossible and whatever, but science fiction, anything's possible. You're arguing over the wrong thing. You idiots. You're arguing over the fact that, oh, retake Mass Effect 3. Now I have played Matt. I signed the petitions. I signed them because I was so pissed off at the ending. And I kind of wish I hadn't signed them now, but I'm not going to take off my signature. The reason that I think you're all fucking idiots and arguing over this, you shouldn't be arguing over that, you should be arguing over the fucking fact that we didn't get a goddamn ending. The game's unfinished. I'll say it right now, the game is fucking unfinished. There is no ending. You can debate on the literal ending, but there is no ending. If you do the destroyer ending, Shepard Reeves, it ends. There is no fucking ending to the game. It's an unfinished game. That's what you need to argue over. That's what you need to say in Mass Effect. Instead of going retake Mass Effect 3, we demand you change the ending. How about retake Mass Effect 3, we demand you give us the fucking ending to the series, you cunts. I don't know if it's Bioware, I don't know if EA personally, it reeks of fucking EA. Excuse me, EA. But, how about we all stop acting like fucking idiots? I'm a, bit, I'm a fucking idiot as well. At the start, I would argue to people... The indoctrination theory is the only theory that makes sense, but the literal theory also makes sense as well. Can we stop arguing and just agree that, well, we each have different opinions? What? Come here. Come here. We have different opinions. Call the presses. I don't believe it. We are allowed to disagree. We're allowed to disagree. Wow. I did not know that. So, can, I know you're probably, I can guarantee you're still going to argue after this video. In fact, I'm guaranteeing I'm going to lose about half my subscriber base. I'm going to lose, fucking, get a dozen fucking dislikes in a minute. I'm going to get angry comments down below, but I don't fucking care, okay? Here's what I just want to say. Stop fucking arguing over the fact that you have a different opinion on how the Mass Effect series would ending. No matter what the fucking ending would have been, there would have been people who wouldn't have fucking liked it. If it was a happy ending, people would have said we didn't want a happy ending. If it was a sad ending, people would be like, oh, we wanted a happy ending. 
BioWare ripped themselves in their fucking corner. There is no way they're going to please everyone. They're not. EA, BioWare, whoever the fuck it is, I don't care anymore. They basically just fucking took the ending out and just went, here's the unfinished fucking game, you cunts. We don't care. So how about instead of arguing over the fact that we have different opinions, well, if you think the literal theory is right, good on you. If you think the indoctrination theory is alright, good on you. We're arguing over it. That's what they want. How about we do something that maybe they not want us to do and... Come here. Come here. Argue with them! That's a theory. How about we just argue with them and say to them, give us the real ending. Because I think we can all agree, the game feels rushed. There are glitches galore. There are a dozen game-breaking glitches in the game. But you all, I can look past that. How about just, we just all agree that maybe that the game is unfinished and we want our fucking ending to Shepard's story? Because there's got to be DLC. There'll be a DLC to release the ending and they'll charge us for it. They'll, now, that is bullshit. They, the fact, they did a DLC for an ending, the ending to the Mass Effect 3 trilogy of Shepard's story. There is going to be a DLC to wrap all this up. There's always an epilogue DLC. That should be free in my opinion, but it won't be. We'll all buy it. Two, there will be a DLC that deals with Omega because I, that I, I just honestly think because we need to find out what happens to Omega in my opinion. There will be other DLCs. The only DLC I want right now, which is supposedly coming in April, is the ending, and it better be goddamn free. But even if it isn't free, I can guarantee I'm going to buy it. I'm not going to lie to your fucking faces and say I'm not going to buy it, because I probably will buy it. We'll all buy it. So, I think I've ranted on enough, and basically, hopefully, opened your fucking eyes, but I probably haven't. You're all probably just going to go, Fuck you, Scottish. Screw you. Just fuck you up the ass. So, I hope, I hope I've opened some of your eyes that we can all stop this fucking squabbling and fucking disagreement on what ending theory is fucking right. The induct theory is right. The literal theory is right. How about we just agree that we didn't get an ending? What? That's not right. Yes. We didn't get a fucking ending. I would be happy with a fucking text epilogue. I would be happy with that. For fuck's sake, I'd be happy with the Animal House one that is on YouTube, Mass Effect 3 Animal House ending. I'd be happy with that. So, that's all I can say of the factor. There are problems with both theories. If you watch the Angry Joe's top 10 reasons why we hate the Mass Effect 3 ending, there are 10, if not more, plot holes in the literal ending of Mass Effect 3. Watch the fucking video and you will see. But at the same time, there are problems with the indoctrination theory. Watch Game of MD's video and you'll see. So, I hope, in vain, in vain, I'm praying. I'm praying to the God of Death that years will fucking stop this argument over the ending. But years won't. Because you know what? We're all fucking sheep. And EA and Bioware are fucking us up the ass. So sheep, get ready. Because EA's gonna fuck you. So is Bioware. I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, thanks for watching. See you all later, cunts.